Did you know that your gut hosts trillions of microorganisms that are essential for your overall health? Yes, it is true. Our digestive system is not just a food processing unit. It is a complex ecosystem that influences everything from our immune response to our mental health. However, most of the time we overlook our gut health and focus on other things for better health. This is where understanding the science of gut health is important. So in today's video, let's understand the science of gut health, why it is so important, and what simple steps you can take to improve your gut health. Let's begin. First, let's dive into what gut health is. Gut health refers to the condition of your digestive system, which comprises the mouth, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, rectum, and anus. All of these work together to digest and absorb nutrients from food and excrete waste. Now let's understand the science of gut health and why it is so important. Our gut is home to the gut microbiome, a complex community of trillions of microorganisms that reside in the digestive tract. These microorganisms include bacteria, viruses, fungi, and other microbes, which together create a balanced ecosystem that influences numerous body functions. Gut health plays a vital role in overall health due to the critical functions the gut microbiome performs. First, the gut microbiome is essential for digestion. Gut bacteria break down complex carbohydrates and fibers that the human body cannot digest on its own. Through fermentation, these fibers are converted into short-chain fatty acids, or SCFAs, which are crucial for energy production, particularly for the cells lining the colon. SCFAs also promote gut integrity by supporting the structure of the gut lining and reducing inflammation. Without this process, nutrient absorption would be degraded, which can cause digestive issues and nutrient deficiencies. Second, the gut microbiome contributes to nutrient production. Certain beneficial bacteria produce essential nutrients, including vitamin K, which is necessary for blood clotting, and B vitamins like biotin or B7, folate or B9, and cobalamin or B12. These vitamins are involved in energy production, brain function, and red blood cell formation. Without these bacteria, the body would struggle to meet its nutritional needs, which can cause various deficiencies and related health problems. Third, the connection between gut health and mental health, known as the gut-brain axis, further shows the importance of gut health. The gut communicates with the brain through neurons, and gut bacteria produce neurotransmitters such as serotonin and dopamine, which are essential for mood regulation and cognitive functions. Since about 90% of serotonin is produced in the gut, an imbalance in the microbiome can cause mental health disorders like anxiety and depression. Therefore, maintaining a balanced microbiome is crucial for both physical and mental health. Fourth, the gut microbiome also acts as a natural defense system by preventing harmful pathogens from thriving. Probiotics, which are beneficial bacteria, compete with harmful microbes for resources and space in the gut. Some probiotics even produce antimicrobial compounds that inhibit the growth of dangerous bacteria. This protective barrier not only prevents infections, but also strengthens the gut lining, stopping harmful pathogens from entering the bloodstream through food. Moreover, the gut microbiome is also related to immune system function. Approximately 60% of the immune system resides in the gut-associated lymphoid tissue, which constantly interacts with the microbiome. A healthy and diverse microbiome helps the immune system distinguish between harmful pathogens and beneficial bacteria, preventing infections and autoimmune diseases. A balanced microbiome strengthens the immune system, making it more efficient at fighting off illnesses and reducing the risk of inflammation and chronic diseases. A healthy gut has a diverse and balanced microbiome. On the other hand, an unhealthy gut has an imbalanced gut microbiome known as dysbiosis, which can cause various health issues, including digestive problems, immune disorders, and mental health concerns. So, this is why gut health is important. Now let's discuss the ways to improve gut health, so you can improve your overall health. Number one, consume probiotics. Probiotics are live microorganisms, mainly beneficial bacteria. As mentioned earlier, these bacteria enhance immunity by preventing harmful bacteria from thriving and reducing inflammation. So, to improve your gut health, consume fermented foods like yogurt, 
kefir, kimchi, and sauerkraut, which are excellent sources of probiotics. Number two, eat fiber. A high fiber diet is essential for maintaining gut health for several important reasons. First, fiber plays a crucial role in supporting digestion by adding bulk to the stool, making bowel movements regular, and preventing constipation. This ensures that waste is efficiently removed from the body and reduces the risk of digestive issues like bloating, discomfort, or conditions such as diverticulitis. Second, fiber, especially prebiotic fiber, serves as food for the beneficial bacteria in your gut. Prebiotics are found in foods like garlic, onions, bananas, and oats. These fibers help nourish and promote the growth of good bacteria, allowing them to thrive. By feeding the beneficial bacteria, fiber keeps harmful bacteria in check and supports a balanced gut microbiome, which is vital for smooth digestion and overall health. Third, when the gut bacteria break down fiber, they produce short-chain fatty acids, which are critical for gut health because they provide energy to the cells that line the colon. This process strengthens the gut lining and helps reduce inflammation. A healthy gut lining acts as a barrier, preventing harmful substances from entering the bloodstream, which can otherwise lead to conditions like leaky gut and systemic inflammation. To get more fiber in your diet, you can turn to a variety of sources like fruits, such as apples, berries, and oranges, vegetables such as broccoli, carrots, and spinach, legumes like lentils, chickpeas, and black beans, whole grains including oats, quinoa, and brown rice, and nuts and seeds like chia seeds, flax seeds, and almonds. Number three, manage stress. The gut-brain axis connects your brain and digestive system, and stress can disrupt this communication. When you are stressed, it can lead to gut issues like indigestion, bloating, and more serious conditions like irritable bowel syndrome. So, it is important to manage stress. For this, you can opt for techniques like mindfulness, meditation, deep breathing, and physical activity, such as walking, swimming, or cycling, that release endorphins, which are natural stress relievers. Number four, get enough sleep. Getting enough quality sleep is another key to improving gut health. Sleep deprivation can alter the balance of bacteria in your gut, leading to digestive problems. Good sleep helps regulate important hormones, like ghrelin and leptin, which influence appetite and digestion. When you're sleep-deprived, ghrelin, the hunger hormone, increases, leading to cravings for unhealthy foods. This can result in overeating and weight gain, both of which negatively impact gut health. Additionally, during deep sleep, your body repairs itself, including the gut lining and immune system. This process is critical for maintaining a healthy gut barrier and preventing conditions like leaky gut. Number five, do not overuse antibiotics. Antibiotics, while effective in treating bacterial infections, can disrupt the balance of your gut microbiome by killing both harmful and beneficial bacteria. Overuse of antibiotics reduces gut bacteria diversity, which can lead to digestive issues like diarrhea and bloating. So, it's important to use antibiotics only when necessary, such as for bacterial infections that the body can't fight off. Avoid using antibiotics for viral infections like the cold or flu, as they are ineffective against viruses and can harm the gut. Moreover, after taking antibiotics, add probiotics and prebiotics to your diet. This can help restore the beneficial bacteria in your gut and support overall digestive health. Number six, avoid processed foods. Processed foods often contain sugars, preservatives, artificial additives, and trans fats, all of which can cause inflammation in the gut lining. Chronic inflammation can damage the gut barrier and cause health problems like autoimmune disorders and metabolic issues. So, reduce the intake of sugary and processed foods and opt for whole foods. That's the science of gut health, why it is important, and how you can improve it. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like it and subscribe to our channel for more informative content. See you in the next video.